welcome back to another video. I have not done these in a very long time. And uh, yeah, starting to kind of miss it. All right, so maybe you only know me for my Gelsoft AKs that I review, mostly all AKs. And you might think that I am someone who likes to play with AKs only, like completely wrong. You're so wrong that you might regret your whole entire life for thinking that I do not only like to play with AKs. I'm going to change your mind today, right now, right here. Just, just don't just click on other videos. That's all. That's all I'm asking you. And subscribe and like or something. I just uh, lead like a flag, and uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you why. Because I've waited this for like half a month. No fancy uh, intro or whatever. Because this, this is just godly. Let me uh lay each every th single thing out we got the uh magazines you might already know it by looking at what it looks like you know i got three of them i'm just gonna lay out one there's the other not very really important and uh got the uh stock a little thing i guess i don't know another thing uh, uh and a oh this is actually pretty cool they gave me a metallic um hop-up of some sort just put that over there in the corner another buttstock of some sort a very peculiar plastic bag thanks a lot i don't know what is this oh i guess i don't know uh the uh thing you put on you know words can't describe oh another one this thing the uh, uh rear drum sight and another one okay thanks a lot Alright, lots of empty now. Look at all this mess. Gigantic. Let's start with these two big bags. I'm gonna go with the left one over here. Okay. Bag's empty as you can see here. Or maybe it's not. Oh. Aha. Alright, now it's not empty again. Yeah, that's it. So over here we have the uh, main gearbox, you know, all your stuff. You got your uh, SM head over here, and you got an extra long SM thing. You know, the trigger is orange, which is disappointing. I'm gonna have to change it. You got a, a, a thing over here. I don't, I don't, I don't really know. Okay. Next black container. This bunch of plastic stuff. Oh, plastic stuff. And uh, more plastic. Oh, this is the upper receiver, I'm guessing. This is the uh, handguard and this and the silencer. So, yeah. That's uh, all of the main components, and uh, let's have a cool little, cool little, not, not exactly montage, but yeah, whatever, you get it. Done. Complete. It took me uh, four hours or so just to put this thing together, and uh, another like two hours to wires and stuff inside. It's absolutely crazy. The only thing right now is this. This is, uh, it's too long. Yeah. Gotta cut it like till about over here. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, so it looks like with the uh, folded, folded buttstock. This is the uh, A1, I think. I don't know. The, the uh, well, big buttstock, which I'm not a big fan of. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, yep, that's about it. Here's the shooting. I took clip. this uh, MP5 out to a actual CQB game. Uh, the game's over, doesn't matter. And uh, let's test it out. Actually, first we're just gonna shoot it at random things. Oh, excuse me, that was uh, that was semi. There we go, full auto.
All right. Friend here to uh, help me hold the uh, meter. So yeah, let's try it out a bit. All right. It the meter. 33. 33. Yeah, not bad for uh, one single shot. All right, let's try multiple. All right, this is this is semi again. So for semi, it's only 36. All right, let's try full auto. There we go, and you go. Uh oh. Oh, for full auto, it's even worse. Let's try your AK. Uh oh. Yeah, my, my AK is like 76 Wait, something. So yeah. Uh, you can see how, it, how well it actually shoots. That's pretty decent for a blaster that's so cheap currently and uh, that I had to put together. All right, let's end the video here. So yeah, this is a pretty good blaster for a um, DIY type of blaster. And uh, yeah, it's pretty good if you want to get into gel blasters and uh, don't really know where to start off at because you put in a good spring into the gearbox, you're pretty much done. I had a pretty crappy spring and uh, even the gels weren't coming out. So yeah, also cool little story, kind of dumb. This thing, I did not know it, you had to put that thing there, the uh, little little metal, metal hook, hooking thing. I did not know you had to put that there until a friend of mine sent, sent a picture of his gel blaster to me and uh, I saw it so yeah Ooh. video ends now uh, thanks for watching be sure to leave a like subscribe comment on which gel basser you would like to see next and I will see you in the next video perhaps